Hello guys, welcome to binaryhackers.com. My name is Rahul Sawan. In this video, I'm going to discuss about the harvester tool that is already available in the backdrive machine. So you do not need to install it again in the backdrive. So it is already available in the backdrive machine. And the harvester tool is an information gathering tool. It's used for the gain information of the particular host of victim host or the DNS server virtual server of particular host so in this video I'm going to use this tool with a different type of option and I'm going to show you how to use that particular option with this the harvester tool to gain the information from the victim so the harvester is found in the pen test enumeration directory open the terminal and let's go to that directory pen test enumeration ls and this is the folder the harvester let's go to that folder and we need to run this python script or python file the harvester.py so let's run that file and this is the harvester version 2.2 the version of the harvester and this is the option that we are going to use with the harvester this all are the options the first option is dash d the domain to search or a company name dash p for the data source for example google and bing so let me show you one example to how to use this all option with the harvester file this is a very useful tool for the scanning particular dns or particular host ok now let's type the file name the harvester.py after that I am going to add one syntax that is a D domain to search the name and for this example I am using this domain ebay.in after that I am using dash l command that is limit the number of the result to work with so I am going to use the result 100 it's okay after that I'm going to use dash B this is the option of the data source and I am going to use a Google for this example press enter now it's searching on the Google for the cache the ebay.in and this all the domains of the host found in the Google search engine or this is all ebay.in uh, game.ebay.in deals.ebay.in so this is all the host found in the google cache of the ebay.in so if you use a different type of search engine your result will be different for example let's use same command and change the search engine name to bing so it's searching on the bing right here and you can see there is it found only three hosts so www.ebay.in deals.ebay.in and store.ebay.in and on the google cache found how it's uh, actually work actually the users are using a google search engine more than a bing Bing is very frequently used on the internet therefore it will display the different type of result the second one I'm going to use it show the result of options the second options I'm going to use a dash V is verify the host name via DNS resolution and search for the virtual host first let's use this dash v option with the harvester use a google 
and after that type dash v so it will scan for the virtual host okay this all are the virtual hosts that found in ebay.com so this is the host found in the search engine this all the ebay gave that already found in the previous example and these are the virtual host so what is the virtual host virtual host or the virtual hosting is a method for hosting multiple domain names on a single server or a pool of server so this allow one server to share its resources such as a memory or processor cycle so this all are the virtual web servers gave.ebay.in gave.ebay.com found in the ebay.in virtual host and the third example the third option i'm going to show in this video is dash t of form a dns tld expansion directory so let's use that option first in dash v i'm going to edit this v and type t and press enter the scanning searching the google for that host ebay.in and now it's searching the tld expansion so what is the tld expansion actually tld is a top level domain okay a top level domain is one of the domain at the highest level in the hierarchical domain name system of the internet the top level domain names are the installed in the root zone of the namespace for all domains in the lower level it is the last part of the domain name that is the last level of the fully qualified domain name or you can say fqdn so these all are the tld expansion of the dns and i think this is the root directory or root zone dot com and after that all are come with the hierarchical hierarchical structure or hierarchical model like ebay.at ebay.be ebay.ca and this is the root of the ebay.com tld expansion so this all the result of the dns tld expansion so this is how to use the harvester tool in backtrack using a different type of options so the other option i'm going to leave it for your practice use this tool with the different type of options and just learn it at your own ways so this is all for this video hope you enjoy my videos if you like my videos subscribe my youtube channel and also like my facebook page thanks for watching